What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Nerd Den. We're back at it with another Let's Play. I believe we're at part six, and I did say we're going to start the settlement. So, welcome back to the Surgical Gaming live Twitch feed. Uh, this is actually a special Sunday stream, and I, I know I'm going to get a little backlash for it. I do say that I, or I did say that I only stream on Fridays and Saturdays, but under circumstances, I just felt like streaming today, and I really want to play this game. Also, the reason why I'm playing this game is because Cyberpunk is coming out in two weeks, and I'm going to spend a lot of time on that, so I may play SAC, like, you know, as a downtime game in between, but we'll see. But if it's your first time following me, thank you for following me on Twitch, and if you miss this stream, you can watch my uh, past videos or just upload. I'll be uploading on Tuesdays and Thursdays on my YouTube channel, and I left the link on my uh, profile. So without further ado, guys, let's get back into uh, the mission called Selling Down. So, welcome back, guys. We are back at Ravensdorf, our new home away from home from Norve to England. And we are in England. We already did the settlement. And uh, so, first and foremost, I just want to let you know that uh, if you're under 13 or the age of 13, please ask your parents for permission to watch this video. Uh, I do curse a lot, and I did not set an age bracket. And while you guys are, you know, waiting for me to come back, I actually unlocked a few new skills, which is this way. Sorry I didn't show you it. Um, I unlocked the uh, melee, melee resistance, light attack, and then which is stun. And then I unlocked this one here, which is evasion. And assassination damage so that way we can do more assassinations and then I unlocked a few more things I think this way so I'm trying to focus on the air arrow but so. so today on the special stream I did promise you we're gonna do settling down so we're gonna speak to gunner about settling down hopefully we can get that cat that's what I wanted <laughs> and these are the completed quests I've already done this is all prologue stuff, which is crazy. Even though it says, like, you know, chapter 4 and 5, which is freaking crazy. <laughs> well, let's go speak to Gunner. Can I help you with anything? Sigurd wants your forge up and running as soon as possible. For that, we need supplies and riches. Ah, you mean to go a Viking then? Good, good. How oh, I miss those days. Ransacking and pillaging. Blade singing. Sound like a pirate. Shield splintering. <laughs> I would ask you to join us, but you're the only blacksmith we have. We cannot afford your loss. Oh, it's no bother. Better I forge axes than swing them. My place is here, not pulling on the war of a river horse. Though you do remind me, I've found a map among the bandits' rubbish, marked up with the locations of Saxon monk huts. Yes, bandits know as well as we do. Monasteries are full of riches and loot. Take the map with you, and put it to better use than they did. Oh, dang. Let's go. Wait a tick. What see you, old friend? Hmm. Well, I guess I gotta settle down before I can get that cat. So, we'll get that cat later. Let's go. Eivor, Lactium Skiwi King. Let's go sailing, boys. Okay, monastery raids. Raiding heavy guarded locations is best way to find wealth chests containing supplies and raw materials. Both are needed to construct buildings and settlements. The raiding is done near nearby wealth and chests have been looted. For years and listen all. For the good of our clan, it is time we go a Viking. Today we raid, that tomorrow we may build. At last! Need to row our way We out. will crack these Christian monasteries like a row of hen's eggs! Oh my god. The Saxons know we are here, though. <laughs> the monasteries will be well guarded. Ah! By nothing more than priests and prayers, I'd wager! Not waiting to start off this game. Let's get out of here. Do I mean boat glitches? Ah, oh, I hate it. Can't race okay, the same. Now I can yet. follow the 
follow. Let's have a song. All right, guys. Run out the sail! Yo ho! Tell the tale of the six Christian monastery, Eivor. Right for plunder. Eivor, look there. A monastery. I stand ready. Only say the word. I mean, technically, I could have just turned around. Hey, thanks for joining me today. All right. So are we leaving? We are scouting, Dag. All in good time. Sorry, this boat's really hard to control. All right, open sail. Where were you? Sorry. You heard me tell the tale of the six Christian missionaries. We can continue later. I think we're just gonna raid here. There's a bunch. They probably heard us coming. Yep. Hold on a second, guys. I'm gonna open the map. This is being ridiculous. I gotta pick a. I gotta pick a place to monast uh, to raid, which is this one here. We tell the tale of the six Christian missionaries. I lured away from their faith into the worship of Almighty Thor. You showed them how to turn the crosses into hammers simply by flipping them over, and they fainted with joy. That tale. Uh, Yes. Right here. Hush now. Look there. I should never hit the horn because we could have just snuck in. Should we be so Remember, lucky? don't kill anybody. We don't. There we go. We're only going to kill the red people, not the innocents. Find what they hide and take it. And kill the guards. Stop. Okay, Miss Being Patient. You're finished. Whoa, whoa. Okay, that works. You out! Patience will reward us. Really? Mm, I feel great. 
<laughs> I ate some kind of myst mystic berry. All right, let's uh, pillage. Got some raw material. There is more. We should claim it. Hell yeah, we're gonna claim that shit. What? Let me loot. Empty box. The hell's that? Oh. Okay, it must be a glitch. <laughs> Unlock the door. Door. <laughs> I need to find a way in here. Yeah, union for you and me. Whoa, no, no, bad idea. Pillagins, rifle the loot. Drink up me heart is your hoe. Kind of want to get a shot at this. Hold on, hold on, chill, 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 dude, chill. Got to get that snapshot, you know, that daily snap. A hand here, Eivor! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, raid completed. Because we're a freaking dope like that. Let's check if you see if we got it. Nope, we didn't get any inventory. I do want to heal up though. Remember, no killing innocents. Don't kill innocents. <laughs> See? 
This is why we explore. Uh, residence notes every, everywhere. Turned up in sickness and monster and plague. Um, <laughs> Usually, those notes tell you where like stuff is buried. Oh, I can disguise. Probably should. Just doing some exploring. I just want to see what else is here. Ooh, bowl of yarn. Yeah, loot everything, guys. Good day and some fine work from all of you. We should return home and unload everything. Are you certain there aren't a few more gold nuggets squirreled away somewhere? My gut tells me no. So, Eivor, that's a lie. What's your cap? We're gonna go on another raid. You hear that? It's just to power 160. Okay, so yeah, <laughs> I can't go. I mean, technically, I could go raiding and do all that other stuff, but um, yeah, no, I'm not gonna die. I have no need to count my kills. They number too many. Likely story, Wolfkist. Me, I killed 26, I think. Ah, there were barely a dozen when we arrived, dog. Say no, no, you missed them. They attacked from the forest! Hold on. That's weird. Did I just choose the hardest mission? Maybe? <laughs> Pretty much we're going back home. I hope you guys enjoyed that raid. I know I did. That was pretty cool. Is there a sea skull among you? Some years ago, I took this. You cannot raise the sail here. No shit. Control yourself. <laughs> I didn't want to do that, but... Back so soon. And we good news, I hope. So those materials we had earlier from the, from the pre prologue, guess what? We took it with us. This is wonderful, Laver. A forge bigger and harder than my old forge back in Fornberg. Come visit me any time. For weapons and gear, there is no man better than me. I will, Gunner. Have no doubt. They Building settlement. Gain access to unique services, settlers, and quests. 
uh, and more constructing buildings in Ravensthorpe, which is our new settlement. To construct a new building, approach the assigned with the post sufficient supplies and raw materials. As the settlement grows, it will grow it will gain renown or yeah, renown yeah, renown and unlock new buildings opportunities. Call Ravens to build it. Call Raven to see all services that are built or available hey, to construct. Lord, what Sorry brings about that. you to my humble shop? Cast about this land, my friend. <gasps> Hidden Ones Bureau. Dope! Stables, so we can actually change stuff. Let's talk to, um... Hatham? Yeah, Hatham. Hatham. Now that you and Bassam are settled, what will you do? We have work to do. Starting in the cities of England. London, Jorvik, Winchester, all three are infested by members of the same order to which Kyotve belonged. But their reach extends much further than this. Of all the lands on Earth, I believe England is the most overrun. Do they cause here the same turmoil Kyotve caused in Norway? Not just turmoil. They spread a plague of delusion, teaching men and women to abase and abuse themselves in exchange for power. You have strong feelings about this. Of course. This is the sole purpose of the Hidden Ones, to liberate the body and spirit of man from any unnatural shackles. But we have not operated in England for over four centuries. Since the fall of the Roman Empire, the Hidden Ones have not had a presence here. This absence <clears throat> has given the Order of the Ancients ample room to grow and thrive. Our task will not be an easy one. But with a bureau, Basim and I could begin our work. If you have the time and spare resources to build one, we would be most grateful. I will see what I can do. Dude, legit. Let's see. Fuck. Okay, I want to look at the hut. I mean, I really want to do assassin's missions. But I also want tattoos. But we gotta go talk to Sigrid, so. Yo, brother. The Saxons Bro their hey, Vod. In here. What will you keep in this room? My finest weapon. For this room is yours. Here you may lay your head, hang your axe, or be alone with your thoughts. Do you like it? It suits me well, but I would be just as happy lodging with the raiders on the wharf. I need no special treatment. This is not special treatment. I want you here in the longhouse, close at hand. I may be the Jarl of this clan, but you and I lead together, as ever. So get acquainted with your room, and when you're ready, meet me at the stables. Mr. Stablitz. Oh, yeah. So. A letterbox for messages and requests. That's cool. Uh, you know that little elk thing that we uh, had? You can actually hang it up there. I think it's gone, but I don't know if it's there still. Uh, Ravenstorp status. Encampment. Behold our new encampment bo Bjorn, born from the soot heat left behind by the sons of Ragnarok. It may look a bit shabby now, but with some effort, we will be soon be a beacon of trade of culture. And of course, I, you know, blocked out the stuff with my other things. Uh, blacksmith, hidden bureaus. Yeah, a lot of good stuff. Hmm. A bed better than many I have slept in, and a good place to recover. Hmm. Awesome. Not much, but it is mine. Wait a minute. We have a letter. We should read it. Oh my god, this is totally Witcher mode, or also, um... No, sorry, not just Witcher. Um... I'm thinking... It was that one game that nobody liked. And it sucked. It's the one with all a bunch of group. Unity, yeah, like that. He's reading the letters. Arnold. Anyways. Finally, we can customize the ship. Thank God. I like the great hold. Looks good. Are you ready to ride at a moment's notice? Count on it, my friend. The path ahead is bright. 
with glory at its end. Farewell, Eivor. But, but why now? Dark, please. This must be done. Yes, and I can help. Look at me. Look at these... What was that about? The spasm leaving us already. Sigurd means to leave as well. Is that true? We know the sons of Ragnar have camped in the north. It would do us well to pay them a visit, to strengthen our ties to this land. Is that where Basim has gone? Basim's motives are his own. Leave it at that. We have more pressing plans. I am riding to Lerichestershire, to a town called Repton. Eivor, I expect you to join me when you have finished here. I can come now. I only need a horse. Not yet. First speak with Randvi. She has more than one task for you here. Apart from growing this settlement, you must seek out alliances as well. We cannot pacify England with so few friends. Then I must join Sigurd's you, giving Sigurd, his command. for I am a fitter companion on long roads. No, Dak. You belong here with the raiders, and you will act as Eivor commands. Ride in safety, brother. I will follow as soon as I can. Yes. And I will keep our raiders sharp. <laughs> Or as Eivor commands. Is he testing me? He may be. Sigurd is a wise man. I would sooner take orders from a louse. Alrighty then. Eivor, my stable is a bit spared just now, but if you can build me something better, I promise you the finest of beasts. A bustling stable would be... I'll see you later, friend. Make sure you talk, talk to, to your raven later. regularly. They like that. A bustling stable would be a great boon here. I'll see what I can do. Ah, decisions. I'm like, this one, I want to go raiding more, but let's go talk to Ravandi. And they call her Cassandra. <laughs> And I got a message apparently. <laughs> Stop it. Um, okay. I just go around in a giant circle? <laughs> I just did. Uh, let's check out that message real quick. I like message is pretty dumb. Uh, Norvid's notes. Eivor, the gods favor us. In a cave near Nordwick, a glimpse of a legend. Oh, okay. So we might get our companion. Oops. Hang on, sorry. Bjorn Bloodtooth. Berserkers make fierce foes, but powerful allies. His strength would bolster our settlement. I should seek him out. Exactly. Sunavai, what's her name? Sunavia note. Uh, the gods curse us, Saxon. Windafilda uh, have arrived at a small village in the East Anglia. Let's see the piece of claims. Claim, claim, and the of the sky. Whatever this beast or monster, defeating it would only add to my reputation. I should meet this abbess, Wolfhilda. See, these are side quests they're talking about. Okay, there's really no main mission but the territories, so that's how that <laughs> there you go. Quest logs, uh huh. Close, thank you. See these? These are other missions. So we're gonna do um, the alliance map because that's it is, but a new home would be good. Let's do that real quick. Actually, no. We're gonna do a lance map. Sorry, I'm, I'm really weird. Ah, there you are. 
Yes, Ravandi, I'm going to talk to you. Speak. Me. As Sigurd has so ordered, it falls to us to expand our presence in England. He wants to forge alliances, ironclad, with every Norse, Dane, and Saxon here. Right. We are the outsiders here. Making friends will help. Where do we start? My scouts come and go daily with interesting news and tidings, and I'm beginning to get my bearings in this fractured land. As I learn more, I can give you insight into each territory before you commit to a journey there. Of course. Once you have gained an ally in a territory, return home and speak to me. We'll decide your next move then. I understand. So where do we start? You have two options just now. Join Sigurd in Leatherchestershire to the north and meet with the sons of Ragnar Lothbrok, or head south to Grantebridgeshire to meet an army of Danes led by one Guthrum Jarl and his second, Soma. I should add, our young friend hmm. Hytham has been conferring with his own contacts in the cities. His research could be useful in winning us alliances throughout the cities of England. Speak with him and see what he needs. I want to see the Alliance map. Definitely, I want to see what's going on. Alliance map. If you want your settlement to thrive in England, your clan must forge alliances. Pledge dun dun, to territories to confirm your interest in alliances. As pledges are completed and allies are made, other territories will be made available. Cool. So nothing that... Oh, hold on. So that's gold... Nothing in East Anglia, Lesnachire. So either here or here. Tell me more about Leatherchestershire. I should like to join Sigurd soon. He traveled to a town called Repton to meet Uba and Eva Ragnarsson. As I hear it, they are on the verge of exiling the current king of Mercia with the hope of installing a king of their own. A bold endeavor. I should be there to help however I can. I think you should. I think so, too. I, I believe in family raided. and... Good. I will send word loyalty. to Sigurd and the Ragnarsons, pledging your assistance. If I were you, I would go by ship. Repton is quite a distance north on the River Trent. <laughs> now they Ubisoft and they're typical uh telling me to spend money. Um let's see. So I kinda wanna do all these still because these are actual uh settlement stuff. Not skills. Not inventory. Well, anyways, let's uh, let's check out the map. See what we can build. Show me what lies ahead. See stables, I do want. I can mess around with the horses, but assassin stuff gets you missions. Yeah, I'm gonna focus on the assassin stuff. I mean, I do want to change my tattoos, but that's not important. I mean, I can always go raiding. This will make a fine space for my work, Eivor. Thank you. Well, if your work benefits us, I will see that you keep it for as long as you live among us. I believe it will, for we have common cause against our enemy. They have dug their claws deep into England. Eradicate them where they are strongest, and the alliances you seek will be far easier to come by. In London, they now operate without restraint. If you were to eradicate them, the city would be in your debt. I will talk with Ranvi about your idea. Get her thoughts. Good. Yet, before you do, there is something else. A gift I wish to share. A gift? What? I cannot show you here. Will you walk with me? 
Heck yeah, dude. I will. Lead on. I guess we're gonna do a mission, Coles, uh, to serve delight. Let's do it. <laughs> what, like I said, this is gonna be a special Sunday stream. I hear a heaviness to your breathing, Hytham. Does your wound still trouble you? It does, I'm afraid. There is a pain in my chest for which I have no remedy. Rest easy, then. So long as your mind stays sharp, you will recover. Of course. Though I am reluctant to displease my mentor. You risk your health and your life to please Basim. That I do not understand. I should not expect you do. When we first arrived, I noted a shadow of suspicion in your eyes. A doubt. A wariness. Is that a question? No. Only an observation. Well, we're going on a boat. Are you, Are you well enough to steer this boat? I am. Have no worry. It is only prolonged stresses that exhaust me. My energy runs low rather quickly. <laughs> I just kind of want to play like an Italy song. What is song. this gift you yeah, wish to give no, me? No, no, it will not come from me. It is a gift you must give yourself. More oh, riddles. What fun you are. Let me say it another way. My gift is not for giving or taking. It is a way of living. Still no clearer. It is a thing better demonstrated than described. Then I will wait. Forgive my jest. This gift we call a leap of faith. It is one of our Brotherhood's most sacred rites. It is not a tool oh, we use nice. against our enemies, but an act we embrace to strengthen our resolve. Like your meditation, it centers our minds, steadies our hands, and purges fear from our hearts. And more practically, it aids our movements, in flight or in stealth. You call it a leap, and we're climbing a rather steep hill. <laughs> there it is again. The shadow of a doubt. Nearly there. Our destination is there. I suspect you mean to throw me off this cliff. Is that it? Please tell me if I'm near the mark. And spoil the surprise? To perform the leap of faith, you must give yourself over to something greater. The gods? Yourself. Embrace the hope that death will not come before you are prepared to meet it. Believe this, and you will fear nothing. Our deaths are prefigured, weaved into the fabric of the world. To fear this would be a waste of worry and tears. Good. Then your mind is already attuned to my lesson. Because you're a good teacher, hate them. And, guys, that's amazing that we are going to do a leap of faith. I mean, that's for every Assassin's game, but I do enjoy in another theme, such as the Vikings, to perform such a leap of faith. And to introduce the Vikings in the Assassin's Brotherhood just makes it more amazing. Look at the settlement. This is a uh, little goal down I there. I will leap first. On my word, you must follow. Lean into your faith, into your strength, and take flight. You want me to jump from here? Yes. I would sooner grow wings and fly away. Thank you for the lesson, but... Wait! And watch! Oh, he hears. Hide them! Hide them! Pig headed fool! Are you injured? You see! My faith grew stronger than my fear! And that loam cushioned your fall! Eivor! I have not seen. Sorry. Gotta take a picture. In the sight of you before! Do not feed your fear! Conquer it! <sighs> I've seen my death in a vision. It was not here. Not today. <laughs> Boom. Ha! A perfect fall! And how did it feel? You spoke true. Sexy. It was madness and vicar, a perching of fear. A gift I give exactly. myself. I see that now. Thank you for showing me the way. Of course. This is the way. And thank you, Eivor, for hearing me out. You call this leap of faith a sacred rite. Do all hidden ones practice this same ritual? As far as I know, 
It is a rite of initiation that dates back to just before the birth of the Christian Jesus. Are you hoping to initiate me? I might try if I believed you would join, but that is not my purpose in England. Basim and I are hunting larger prey. The Order of Ancients. Yes. You remember the medallion you took from Kyotve's body? That is their symbol. They are a plague, one we hope to purge from this world. Like us, they act in secret. But their aim is to rule the world, not free it from unnatural fetters. The desire to rule is not unique to this order. Sigurd and I want the same, a land to call our own, and the honor that comes with it. Do not compare yourself to such people. The Order has no honor, no principles, no humanity. Yet they sit on a great many of England's thrones. If you seek to pacify England for the safety of your clan... Then it may be in my interest to give you aid. I understand. You desire alliances. We seek to rid England of its deepening rot. Where these hopes meet, our cause does too. You may think this land ruled by harmless jarls and bumbling thanes, yet look more closely and you will find a deeper threat. The Order's invisible hand touches all. It shapes everything, instilling its poison into every level of society. From the lowliest fishmonger to the richest merchants, from wealthy thanes to useless kings, the Order has corrupted all. Oops, sorry. Basim <laughs> has given time. me one task here. To locate and eliminate the Order of Ancients in England, in whatever dark corners they reside. If we work together towards this end, it will benefit us both. You will have greater influence over the kingdoms of England. And you will have more medallions to count. Exactly. You should begin in London. I have credible reports that the Order is working now to seize the city. I will speak with Ranvi about this. And while you are there, be on the lookout for our symbol. Centuries ago, the Hidden Ones had bureaus built around England. There were six, I believe. If you can find them, search them well for documents bearing the same symbol. It will greatly aid my studies. I will. Thank you, Hytham. For all of this. Oh, dang. The Order of the Ancients. The Order of the Ancients is a secret society of pagans that has infiltrated the every level of society to spread their dogmatic worldview, which is you know, means ideological corruption. Think of, you know, dictatorship. Anyways, to root them out, clues can be found across the world. Zealots are hired of mercenaries that are resist the order to enforce their decree. Finding them and lending them will provide clues in the identity of the order members. Avail and eliminate. Clues are also earned by forging alliances, exploring England, and assisting those in need. Once those clues, particular members are found, their identities that are revealed, and they can be tracked down. Lastly, order hierarchy, of course. Order members are hierarchy system. Assassinating the Palatinus to Proos will provide their intel, and magistrate eventually reveal the Grand Magister rate of the order. So, main head dude. And, uh, looks like we got a few clues going on. Because they're based on the paper we found. We found, uh... So, apparently she's an ally. And then also another ally. We already eliminated Kyofe because he's a douchebaggy. We'll see. We have a choice to either kill them or not kill them. All right, to serve the light. It's like Callum's, Callum's thing right there. So we got more quests coming up. Breaking the order, finding first kill order. All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna stop it here. Thank you for joining me, and of course, we'll come back and do the Sons of Ragnarok. We may do some side missions, which is considered side missions here. I mean, they said no side missions, but that's how it is. Um, but thank you for following me today on the special stream. I will be posting this on either Tuesday or Thursday with my other first uh, Let's Play, which is part of the part four and five, or is it probably five? I have to look into that. But I hope everyone have a great day. Thanks for.